Hello, in this video I'll be showing you how to install Cobot on Pterodactyl. First of all, you'll need to make sure you have the following packages installed. Autoconf, Automake, G++, LibTool, and Build Essential. If you head over to docs.cobot.dev, you can see the dependencies there. As I'm running Ubuntu, I'll select the apt-get command. So if I click copy, then go back over to my terminal, and just right click click enter. This will now install the packages for me. After the packages are installed, head over to the GitHub that they provide, like place hd forward slash eggs. Go to the cobalt egg, click raw, and click control s, and save it in the place that you remember. Now go to your pterodactyl, go to the admin panel, go to nests, create new, then name it discord, set anything in the description, go back to nests, click import, and now select that file that you just downloaded. Then associate a nest, go to discord, import. You may need to restart docker. Now you've imported the egg, you will need to restart daemon. So if I go back over to my command line, I type in service wings restart. Since I have now restarted wing slash daemon, head over to your servers and create a new server. So I'll call mine testing. The owner will be load. Cobot only needs 500 megs of RAM. It doesn't even need that. It needs around 250-ish. I'm going to storage down for Discord. Cobot, Discord Egg, Node.js, version 1.3. And just click Create Server. This may take up to 5 to 20 seconds, depending on the internet speed of your machine. As you can now see, the server is up. If I go to File Management, it has automatically installed the new modules. So let's load Cobot. And then go back to File Management, right-click, decompress, and start the bot. As you can see, it says running NPMI. The first time it will crash. Then just click start again. To disable SQLite being installed every time you start up, go to configuration, startup commands, and in additional startup command, type in dash dash no install. Then click save. Go back to your console, click start. Let's say you accidentally deleted your new module's files whilst updating. That's not the end of the world. All you have to do is go to your admin panel, servers, select your cobot server, click manage, and click reinstall server. This will only overwrite the new module's files, nothing else. And when you've done that, just click go back to the server, and as you can see, no modules are back. And just click start and they run like brand new. Thank you for watching. If you need any favorite support, open and take it on the Discord server.